Well, this week is Fall Prevention Week across Canada in an effort to raise awareness of the risks associated with seniors falling and the consequences that a bad fall can have. One in three seniors falls in their home each year, but healthcare providers say with a few simple retrofits, many of those accidents are preventable. CTV's Erin Glazier reports. And I'll do it myself, Pat. Yeah. I got the... 81-year-old Sonia Clayton likes her independence, but getting around isn't as easy as it used to be. Everywhere you go, there's stairs. Not little ones, big club stoppers. Oh, my goodness. She uses a walker when she's out and about, but like many other seniors, she's suffered a few falls inside her home. I took the carpet with me for support, but it brought me down. The numbers show she's not alone. Every year, 33% of elderly people fall in their own homes. And in hospitals, 85% of seniors admitted for injuries were hurt in falls. They cause a lot of pain and cost a lot of money. In 2010, health care costs due to falls across North America hit $30 billion. Okay, got it. Mm -hmm. So Sonia decided to get a little help. Doesn't and first up. on the list so, for her um, home care provider, uh, a safety check. A chance. So bathrooms are always very high risk of falls. Holy from the use, simple installation to, of a stabilizing handle in the bathroom uh, to either prevent them from falling or if they do feel themselves falling something to grab a hold of to stop the impact. To, the to addressing safety so measures in the kitchen. kitchen. Are that there is no or very minimal upper cabinets. Um, that reduces the risk of having to reach for things that are out of seniors grasp. Small changes cabinets, that have a big impact. Are, Most of the things are things you don't even think about. You see them every day. Uh, you don't think that they could be a potential hazard. So were a new set of eyes to come into your house and reduce that risk a little bit for you. Not taking their medication is also a leading cause of seniors falling in their homes, but this machine can ensure they take their prescription drugs on time and accurately. Take medicine with food. The Vancouver Island Health Authority subsidizes medication dispensers for patients on income assistance, or they can be rented for about $120 a month. Not only does it tell you when, but it lets us know or your, your family know when you haven't taken it. So if you have fallen, if you are on the floor, uh, we know and we can send somebody out, make sure that you're all right. Just one more fail-safe to allow seniors to live in their homes longer with a sense of independence and safety without having to utter the words Sonia did. I fell a couple hours ago and I can't get up. Erin Glazier, CTV News, Langford. Yeah.